champion moment for myself would probably have to be in 2014 when I won my uh, fifth world championship. I got hurt uh, in the summer and ended up making the national finals and came back and won uh, my fifth gold buckle. Calgary Stampede's always been special to me, but uh, being probably the last year that I'll be competing, it's, it's an honor to be able to come up here and compete in the Stampede again. The atmosphere and the environment here at the Stampede is amazing. Uh, the committee does a great job, they put on a great show, and they have top-notch competitors and top-notch livestock. When I was younger, I used to train quite a bit. We'd practice three, four times a week. Now that I'm older, I do a lot of mental preparation, uh, try to ease up the stress on my body. The horse I'm riding, her name's Baby. She belongs to Sam Dixon uh, in Arkansas. She's a great mare. They rode at the national finals last year. A lot of heart, a lot of try, and can really run. When I was young, we grew up junior rodeo and high school rodeo, and, but from the time I was in high school, I idolized guys like John W. Jones Jr., another Californian that was a world champion, and from that point on in high school, I knew I wanted to be a rodeo cowboy. My favorite stampede memory, there's so many of them, but uh, you know, making the four man, having a chance to run at that 50,000 or 100,000, what it is now, and you know, those moments are something that are ingrained in my brain. They'll stick with me forever. One of my favorite foods in the Midway used to be the pocket dogs. I don't know if they make those anymore, but uh, the mini donuts are dang sure another great go-to.